I'm, 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 I'm in tremendous shape, you know, I'm, I feel the career best condition. We're in Hamburg as David Hay prepares for his world title showdown and... Turning now to tomorrow night's big boxing showdown when David Hay takes on the Ukrainian Vladimir Klitschko. If the Londoner wins in Hamburg, he'd add three world title belts to the one he has already. Lose and he comes home with nothing. This afternoon he came in two stones lighter than Klitschko, but he's been bolstered by a huge influx of fans who've brought some home support all the way from London. Rags Martel reports now from Hamburg. This is a heavyweight contest, winner takes all. David Hay preparing for the fight of his life. Standing in his way, Vladimir Klitschko. Ladies and gentlemen, the reigning and defending WBA heavyweight. At the weigh-in this afternoon, both men came face to face. How do you feel about the fight? I feel great. I'm, 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 in, I'm in tremendous shape. You know, I'm, I feel the best, career best condition, and I'm looking forward to putting on a tremendous fight tomorrow night. Ninety-six point five kilos. Hay will have to punch above his weight. He faces a giant of a man, Klitschko, three inches taller and two stone heavier. He's not used to someone coming in as confident as I am, coming in shape like me. If you look at the last few of uh, Vladimir's opponents, they've all come in their stomach hanging over their shorts. They've been completely utter disastrous condition before the fight's even started. So it's the first time he's actually fought a real athlete. At 30, Hay is younger. Klitschko, five years older. The Londoner has a career record of 25 wins, one defeat. The Ukrainian, 55 victories, three defeats. Hay has 23 knockouts to his name, Klitschko 49. The Briton is the current WBA champion, his opponent, the reigning WBO, IBF and IBO champ. The winner will go home with all four belts. Rex Martel reporting there from Hamburg. It's uh, certainly been a very interesting day in Germany as well. David Hay has described his fight tomorrow night as the biggest of the decade when he takes on Vladimir Klitschko for the IBF and WBO heavyweight championship belts in Hamburg. Despite the fact he gives away more than two stone in weight to his Ukrainian-born opponent, Hay is confident of unifying three of the four heavyweight belts, as Oli Foster reports from Germany. Well, this is where the fight is going to be. We're just about standing on the center circle at the Imtech Arena, home of Hamburg FC. They are building the ring for what is being seen as the greatest heavyweight fight of the past 10 years. David Hay against Vladimir Klitschko. Four belts on the line. In a moment, we'll hear from both fighters, but we've already had the weigh-in. Klitschko by far the heavier man weighing in, about two stone heavier than Hay, three inches taller as well. Klitschko the favourite for this fight, he's got the WBO, the IBO, the IBF belts. David Hay just the WBA version. It's been a pretty lively week here in Hamburg with Hay trying to get underneath the Klitschko skin, he thinks he's succeeded. What's he been saying? He's called him a robot. That was pretty tame. He says he's going to put the Ukrainian in hospital. Manny Stewart, uh, Lennox Lewis's former trainer, who's looking after Klitschko, he didn't like that one little bit. That put his back up. So that's upset the Klitschkos as well. He's posted a link to a video spoof of Adolf Hitler, would you believe it, talking about the fight. Hay has been trying everything, but get him away from that environment, as I did a little bit earlier this week in Hamburg. He is a completely different character. This, this, this is the one that the boxing fans want, the public want. This is, this is the biggest you know, boxing match in the last 10 years by far. And uh, I'm just fortunate to be part of it. You know, um, I've done everything humanly possible to make the fight happen. Um, and it's here, you know, Vladimir Klitschko. You know, he's considered by many people to be the number one heavyweight on the planet. Even though I've got the WBA heavyweight championship of the world, he, he also has uh, recognized uh, heavyweight titles. So we're putting them all on the line here. And this, this one's for all the marbles, and um, I, I cannot wait to get in there Saturday night. So David Hay, sure that he will be leaving here with Vladimir Klitschko's three belts to add to his own WBA title. But what about Klitschko, the man who hasn't been beaten for seven years, who holds those three belts? 
I'm doing a lot of things in my life pretty good, but at the best, I box. And uh, I really, I really love my job. I'm a little bit, you know, older now than I used to be 10 years ago. I'm 35 years old, and can you imagine I beat up people for living, still beating up people for living. But it's in a sporting way, and it's in a challenging way, it's on the rules, and, I, uh, and I'm a boxer, by the way. So I, I enjoy to have the best team uh, in the world that I have, and uh, to face probably one of the toughest opponents in my life. I'm always expecting great challenge from the, from the opponents. And I'm uh, always expecting the best shape of my opponents. And that's what I'm expecting from David Hay. I will not underestimate him. I will not overestimate David Hay. And I will do and use everything what I can this night. I'm looking forward to this challenge. And especially because it's from David Hay. It's not about the titles. It was going to be on the line. It's about the fight itself. And that's why I'm, I'm a happy man. Right, we've heard from the two men who are going to be getting into the ring. What about the great and the good who will be flocking to the Imtech Arena here to see this super fight. We caught up with one of them who's been involved in a fair few super fights of his own. Well, hopefully in the first round it's, it's going to be like a chess match. Hopefully, uh, you know, we see a lot of action. I think uh, Vladimir really can't wait. He has to go out there and prove that he's the heavyweight champion of the world. If he waits around, it's not going to be good for him. But obviously David is a champion in his own right as well. Oh, absolutely he's a champion. But, you know, he's got a lot of things against him right now. He's got weight against him. He's got height against him. He's got experience against him. He's got... Uh, Emmanuel Stewart in the corner, he's a trainer of champion. He's also uh, fighting the other guy's backyard. On paper, it's Klitschko. My heart goes with David. If there's anybody that can really do it, it's him. He's, a, he's this era's, you know, Muhammad Ali, you could say. Good looking, he can move quick, he doesn't get hit. He's prepared for this fight with his other past fights, the seven footer. He, he almost knocked him out. And uh, Audley Harrison, he knocked him out. So when he stepped up, he's really uh, answered the question, can he knock out bigger guys? Yes, he can. Heavyweight unification fights are so few and far between. That's why everyone's getting so excited about Hay versus Klitschko on Saturday night. Of course, we'll have all the build-up here on the BBC News Channel and Radio 5 Live. We'll have live commentary on the fight tomorrow evening as well. But from Hamburg, for now, that's all from here. Yeah, just to confirm, as Ollie said, this full commentary on Hay versus Klitschko on Radio 5 Live from 9.45 tomorrow night.